free, I, I would like to, to, to enjoy. Yeah, yeah. If you're free and you have time, you or you can always uh, you can always replay these. They they record these live. Oh, it can, it can, oh, I can replay it. I just know well, it. Yeah, you can, and you can go back and replay all of them. Oh, thanks, thanks for your advice. And listen to them. Like now, this this one is being recorded, so you can after this live stream, you can go back and watch this live stream and, and listen to yourself. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, I will try. I will try. <laughs> uh huh. You can listen. You can listen to yourself because a lot of times people will say they'll say. Um, I went back and watched the replay of the live stream, and you know what? My English is not so bad. It's pretty good. <laughs> yeah, hopefully I can have the big surprise. <laughs> yeah, because a lot of times people will say, you know what? My English isn't very good. I don't. I'm. I'm. I don't want to go on stage to talk to Todd, and because my English is good. So finally, they build up the courage to do it. And then I tell them to watch the replay. Yeah. And I said, "See, your English is a lot better than you think it is." Yeah, that's right. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so great. So your um, um, so the virus basically has affected your travel. So do you like to travel a lot? Yeah, definitely. Sometimes. Yeah, I travel a lot, but I, I can only travel sometimes. Uh, I I would like to travel around that around China, you know, because even some of some of the provinces I haven't been to, and it, uh -huh. especially with my my whole family, my family and, and with sure. my my son, and share together, because yeah. he's only so, he's only five years old and he was born in the year of, uh, twenty seventeen, so it's only five years old and uh, he hasn't gone any places, you know, it's, especially the pandemic. <laughs> yeah, the pandemic started, you know, when he was three years old. Yeah. So you know he's so for the last three years or two couple years yeah. he's basically <laughs> just been <clears throat> locked down, yeah. not not able to travel very very many places. Yeah, and 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 uh, it's lucky that we are in Beijing. You know, cause we can see many things even better than any sure. other provinces. The the children. Sure. Yeah. yeah, Beijing has a lot of uh you know great, you know you're never really bored in yeah, Beijing. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> a lot of nice parks, a lot of museums, lots of things for kids, lots of things for adults, lots of things to do here. That's why I love living here is because I'm never bored. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Unless and, I'm locked down. <laughs> yeah, and also but, also you work in Beijing and a lot of people can speak English and also can understand English. So sure. you, you, yeah. yeah, you won't have the trouble to communicate. communicate. Right. Yeah, yeah, in you know, because I don't speak Chinese, so a lot of my coworkers and of course most of my all of my friends can speak a little English, so they can communicate with me very very easily. Yeah, I'm, yeah. I'm also it, I'm I'm also kind of like a surprise that you you just you just tell us that you you've been staying in, in China for eleven years old, uh, eleven uh, eleven eleven years, yeah. eleven years, I, yes. Yeah. I, I think your English, your Chinese even is, is better now. Mm -mm. You can you can speak a lot. No. <laughs> no, I never learned Chinese. You know, to learn a language, like when you learned English, you learned it in the beginning in a classroom. Mm -hmm. Right. Yeah. <clears throat> Probably in primary school, you learned English in a classroom. Yeah, that's right. <clears throat> yeah, for me to learn Chinese, I would have to go to a school. To start, because I'm a level zero, mm -hmm. I would have to learn from level zero. I would have to learn in a classroom, mm -hmm. and you know, I'd never really had the time to attend Chinese classes to learn how to speak Chinese. Actually, it, it's okay that you can learn some like a basic basic uh, communication, like a uh, sentences. It's okay. Yeah, <laughs> I, I think can, I, I yeah, can you speak can speak a, few, a lot. Yeah, I can speak a few words. But I can't really carry a, a conversation or speak um, uh, a long sentence at all. But I can I can understand and speak a few words if I if we call it survival Chinese. Yeah, yeah, I can survive. I can survive. I've survived a long time. Can I read the Chinese characters. I, I can read, recognize. I can read a few characters. Yeah, a few okay. characters, but I haven't really studied characters either. <laughs> that that's the most difficult part for for foreigner to learn Chinese. Sure. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I have some friends that can speak Chinese, some foreigner friends, but they cannot read the characters or they cannot write the characters, but they can speak some 
some Chinese. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, it's um, yeah, since but living in Beijing and sometimes I travel a lot for business trips for my company. And, you know, if I go to Shanghai or Chengdu or Shenzhen, it's also very, very easy to uh, to uh, be able to communicate with the people in those bigger cities. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so uh, that's nice. But I suppose if I go to a small village someplace, you know, maybe they don't speak such good English. Yes, <laughs> but it, so most of the most of them can understand, but they cannot be able to speak it out. They yes. cannot be able to. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they can't. And but like our previous guest on stage, she said she lives in a small village, and her English is pretty good. Yeah, yeah, I just May. Heard that. Yeah, May, I yeah. thought her English was really good. She said that you know she lives in a small village someplace, and but you know for living in a small village, you know she I thought her English was really good. Yeah. Also, May says, uh, May just said, English is also her hobby. You know, at, when you learn learn when when the learning English is a hobby, I think you you can you can you do can learn a lot and you do can yeah. speak it better, maybe like that. <laughs> because as, yeah, because of because as a hobby, it can be fun. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it can be fun. Now, if they're in, if they're a student at a university and they have to learn English to take an exam, uh, then it's not so fun. Yeah, <laughs> it's not so fun if you have to take like an IELTS exam or a TOEFL exam or maybe uh, CET four or CET six. It's not yeah. so fun. But if you just have, if you're just learning English as a hobby, then it's fun. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Great. Yeah. So, do you have any questions that you want to ask me, Eric? Do you live yeah, in Chaoyang uh, District or which uh, district? I'm living in Dongcheng District. Dongcheng. Dongcheng. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah so, so I have I have question that. Uh, uh, it's about your 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 private, not not like personal personal question. Like, uh, you've been living in in China for eleven years old. So, how long you haven't been go back to your America? Um, uh, have you well, got been homesick? To, yeah, I used to go back to the states every year. The oh, last every time, year. the last time I was back was two thousand nineteen. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so right before now, the pandemic. Right before the pandemic yeah. started. I went in the autumn of 2019. So I used to go back once a year for about a month. Yeah. <laughs> so what, yeah. what about what about when you got like? Uh, do you live with your family here? No, I'm no. I'm here alone. But oh. you know, but I I have lots of friends. But like yeah. when my when my uh, family in America wakes up this morning, because now it's morning. It's going to be morning in in America. Thanksgiving yeah, yeah, morning. Right. Yeah. So once my family wakes up this morning, I can video chat with them. <laughs> yeah, I can video yeah. chat with them and say Happy Thanksgiving. <laughs> yeah, it's better. It's like yeah. a family yeah, reunion so, online. <laughs> yeah, we can do it. You know, with technology, it's pretty easy to you know have a a family to include me in the family reunion. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Even though I'm not there to taste all the delicious food, but I can still see everybody and talk to them. Yeah, but <laughs> when, so, when the t when the pandemic is over, you you can invite them to go travel China. Yeah, right? yeah. When the <laughs> pandemic's over, I plan to travel back to the states to see them. Yeah, but welcome, well, big, well, warm welcome them. Sure, because <laughs> it'll be maybe maybe it that'll be next year. I hope. Yeah, I hope hopefully next year, two thousand <laughs> maybe two thousand twenty three. Uh, I keep saying next year, next year, next year. <laughs> yeah, just to wait, 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 wait. <laughs> yeah, every year I keep saying next year I'll go back. Next year I'll go back. Yeah. So, <laughs> I didn't plan on this lasting this long, but it's okay. At least I'm healthy. My family understands that you know I can't come back. They're so they're they're okay with that because they just want me to be safe and ha and healthy. Yeah. <laughs> so, um, so, so we'll see. Maybe next year I can go back and visit them. Yeah. <laughs> great. So good. Good luck to to Thanks. everyone. <laughs> so do you have any yeah. other questions tonight? Uh, today, no, no, Eric? no. Yeah, that's all. Thank you so okay. much. Thank you so yeah, much. Thanks for coming Thank up you. on stage, and it was nice to meet you. Take care yeah, nice and enjoy you. Yeah. enjoy your um, time with your family. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you so okay. much. Be safe. Be uh -huh. safe. <laughs> Thank you. Bye bye. Okay, bye bye. Ah, thank you, Eric. Yes, Eric's located in Beijing. And in case you didn't know, uh, in Beijing now, 
in Beijing now, we are experiencing some issues, I guess I'm going to say minor issues. For some people, it's major issues if they happen to be locked down. So, uh, yes, we're, we're going through kind of a uh, outbreak in the coronavirus. Um, uh, lots of cases in Beijing. So, And not just Beijing, other cities in China are also going through this situation as well as our not, uh, before Eric came up on stage, we had May uh, on stage, and she had explained to us how she's, you know, locked down in her village. So, you know, she's not locked down in her home, but anyway, um, she's locked down in her village. But anyway, so a lot of people in different cities and villages in China are experiencing some problems. So, um, it is, um, it is basically. Um, yeah, it, 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 it is kind of like, you know, a lot of people going through these problems that they are uh, experiencing. So uh, anyway, hi, Tian. Ni hao. Ni hao ma. Ni hao ma. Ni hao ma. Ni hao. Hi. Oh. Uh, let me see. Hi. <laughs> ah. Tian, couldn't turn on your microphone. Let's see. We'll try it again. Hi. Oh. Sorry. Did you have some technical issues, Tian, maybe? <laughs> Hello. Hello. Knock, knock, knock. Anybody home? Hello. Ah, I see. So we're having some, maybe some small technical issues, huh? Okay. We'll give you a break. We'll try it again later. Hello from Bangkok. Wow, two people from Thailand. How are we so lucky to have Bam and Jane? Maybe Jane? Yeah. How lucky are we? Two people from Thailand today. I'm so blessed. Uh, okay, thank you for joining us today. It is yes, a afternoon, afternoon live stream, an afternoon live stream this afternoon. I just decided I had some time. I think no, no messages. So just an afternoon live stream. Thank you for joining us this afternoon, everybody. Thank you. Happy Thanksgiving. Hello. Hello. How are you? Um, <laughs> my English is not very good. <laughs> well, I think it's I think it's okay. Um, I think you're, uh, where, are you are you in class? Uh, um, do you? <laughs> you want to turn your camera off? Do you... <laughs> Do you have a question? Uh, 
<laughs> Hello. Hello. I. How are you? Oh, I'm fine. <laughs> oh, okay. Uh, what's your name? Um, my name is uh, Wang Zhaojun. Do you, do you have an English name? Um, I'm. No. Uh, <laughs> no English name. Uh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> so where are you? Uh, where are you? Where are you? Are you, are you at? Are you in your school? Uh, <laughs> oh, I, I, um, I'm from China. You're from China. Uh, okay. What city? What city? Beijing. Um, uh, Jiangsu. Jiangsu. Oh, cool. Jiangsu. Wow. Jiangsu. Nice to meet you. Um, nice to meet you too. <laughs> Whoa, your English is good. Uh, uh? Your English is good. Um, I, um, I English is is um, uh, <laughs> You can say my English, my English is getting better. Uh, I uh, yes. Okay. Oh, oh very very bad. <laughs> Not very very bad. Uh, the. <laughs> um, but but uh, um, uh, so that we you you should be so easy. I'm I'm trying to uh. I'm, uh I'm trying to learn. I'm, I'm trying to learn. I'm trying to learn. Uh, I'm trying to learn. Wow, very good. I'm trying to learn. Oh, cool. Wow. Very nice. Oh, thanks. Yeah. Very good. Thank you, thank you. Um, the first time I tried to say, the first, the first time I uh, tried to say. Oh, the first time, it's the first time you tried to speak, uh, right? Um, okay. Yeah. Yes. Well, that's very good. Um, <laughs> uh, <laughs> um I... <laughs> I work hard to learn. I work hard to be. I, I work hard to learn. Um, you can say, yes. I work hard to learn. I work, I work hard to learn. Good. <laughs> Very good. So, yeah, keep practicing. Practice. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Uh, okay. Do you, have, do you have a question for me? Uh, do you have any questions? Do you have any questions that you want to ask me? Uh, oh, oh, uh, oh. Um, is there a good uh, word to learn English? Yes, if there's a very, you should try to find a good teacher. A good, oh, yes. Okay, you need to find a good teacher. Oh, yes, yes, a good teacher. <laughs> yes, okay. Okay, okay. Okay. Thank you, thank you. Uh -huh. thank You're you. welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Thank okay. you. Bye-bye.
拜拜，拜拜，拜拜。Ah、uh, yes,、um, people who like that. I know she's shy, but you know, it takes a lot of courage for that young girl to come up on stage and chat with somebody who does not speak Chinese. <laughs> Now, if I spoke Chinese, our conversation may have been different. You know, because. Uh, I could communicate with her in Chinese, but that's not what she wants. She wants somebody to communicate with her in English. So,、uh, if I could speak Chinese, sure, our conversation we would have been we would have been here、uh, talking, speaking Chinese back and forth together. But since I don't speak Chinese, I can't do that. So, with my private students whom I tutor, they know I don't speak Chinese, so they have to force themselves to speak English, which she, you know. A very very shy girl, but just maybe not too confident in her English, which that's normal at her level because her English level is maybe lower.、Uh, but I think with time, I think with time she will improve. With time, she will improve. Her English will improve in time. She just has to keep working, keep trying, 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 and I think in time. She will improve. That's、uh, that's what I, I I really admire. I really admire her for you know trying so hard to try to improve her English. So anyway, thank you so much for coming up on stage. You didn't have an English name, and I can't remember your Chinese, your Chinese name because I'm horrible. I'm horrible with names. So. So thanks everybody for joining us this afternoon. Yes, I don't usually stream in the afternoon.、Um, if you like to come up on stage, you can raise your hand. Raise your hand if you'd like to come up on stage and chat.、Uh, be patient. I'll try to get as many people up on stage as possible. I still have some time left.